Now this week, Chinese businessman Tony Xia completed his takeover of English Premier League side Aston Villa. The purchase brought to an end the 10-year reign of American Randy Lerner, who leaves the club after a disastrous campaign which saw them relegated to the championship with just two wins all season. Now the move has raised some eyebrows in England, but Xia wants fans to know he plans to bring back good times to Villa Park. Mike Fox has details. The beach ball protest from Villa fans during their final home game was their way of showing they want change. And it arrived in the form of Chinese businessman Tony Shear, who completed a 110 million US dollar takeover of the club this week. And he hopes to bring Villa back from despair. The most important thing for now and the first priority things uh, for the club is to be promoted. If we can do it right away, one year. And uh, after that, uh, we are trying to get the uh, club back to the top six. Uh, club in the premiership, uh, which uh, Villa should be. His recon group owns five publicly listed companies on the stock exchanges in China and employs 35,000 people from 75 different countries. But despite this huge amount of power, he wants the Villa faithful to know he won't interfere with the football decisions. We, we may need to face, face a lot of uh, uh, problem uh, existed before, uh, but I will not do something like jump in uh, to interfere with their final decision. So, for example, I will not push them to accept a Chinese player to, to be uh, the one in the field. As for now, the question on everyone's lips is who is going to take charge in the dugout at Villa Park? I, I would rather keep it a secret uh, for one more week. And uh, I'm sure, like, uh, I hope all the fans, and uh, including myself, uh, will accept he will be the right, right one. Mike Fox, CCTV.